<laughs> and you're laughing. <laughs> You are laughing. Pretty funny, laid back, and outgoing. They just don't like deviating from their schedule. Mm, I don't know. So, uh, yes and no. See, a lot of that is in your wheelhouse. <laughs> okay, let's keep it going. If uh, I want, but because we're coming to the end of the show, we yeah, need to say me. Uh huh. You want to do you? Okay. Libras can be equally quite determined and strong-willed. Uh, apparently, in famous indecisiveness is another case of misleading appearances for a Libra. <laughs> uh, let's see. Your weakness lies in your insecurities and, in some cases, emotional shallowness. They're pretty good at hiding them, though. Hmm. Okay. Emotionally shallow. That's what I mean. Sometimes you look at it, you think. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, a cancer. Cancer has a reputation for being intuitive, sensitive, and profoundly empathetic. Reality, however, begs to differ. <laughs> oh my God. Apparently, cancer can often feel hurt, wronged, rejected, or deceived by others for no legitimate reason. Oh dear, as a result, they're overcome with bitterness and let their ego cloud their judgment and undermine their altruistic impulses. People, are, hold on, who did I miss? Oh, Sagittarius. Sagittarian people are open-handed as they are open-hearted, but are also some who are miserably stingy, probably because they think that in order to make their ambitious plans come true, they have to save as much money as possible. I mean, people, I paraphrase from that. I did not go through the whole thing. There's a lot more there. If you want to read, you know what to do. At Ask Cavani's show and on the Facebook group page. Woo! Add on LinkedIn because uh, mm, 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 mm. time is running out on me today, people. Seriously. Can I goes. ask one last thing as we end the show? Yes. You know the one thing that we did not do as, uh-huh. as I post link number 10 is what you just uh-huh. said. Uh-huh. We did not read our horoscopes for the oh, day. Oh, dear. We didn't. So oh. You need to actually read our horoscopes for today. I have not <laughs> looked at mine. I am... I I marked the pages, but I did not look at mine. Well, I don't know what mine says. Have you it's, found? Them? I've I've found them, and so if you would like, I will. I'm going to. Oh yes, please. Post something. Well, posting number ten, okay. and then I am going to read our horoscope. Come <laughs> 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 tell the world what it says. And and let's just see if we are in line or if it mentions the chaos that sometimes goes on in the background and let's see if if it actually fits okay and so everyone go out there and make sure you check link number 10 chinese zodiac animal signs okay and and i am a tiger people just so you clear okay that she's right this has nothing to do with her she didn't say anything but this is the and I'm going through, and I'm doing. I've got Libra, and I have Capricorn. And so, which okay, one do you, which one do you want to hear first? Okay, you can do yourself first. Okay, Libra. This is for me, September 10th. This is the perfect day to reassess the current situation of your life and prioritize your projects. If you have been lazying, mm-hmm. is that a word? L a z i n g, lazing, lazing, lazing. lazing. Really, really oh yeah, I guess it's lazing. If you have been lazing for some time now, and letting work pile up today, you will find an amazing surge of energy, which will help you to organize your projects satisfactorily. This is the best time to discard those which are no longer useful, and finish the others instead of starting a new project. I'll have to feel. I'll have to say that's somewhat actually the way I woke up today. <laughs> I cleaned up my desk yesterday, literally, so that I could get some things done. That's a okay. So okay, I'm back on that side of the pendulum now. Uh, okay, Capricorn, your inner strength lets you undergo some multi-level thinking. You are able to see varied sides of an issue. You are right in judging your friends and pe- you are right yeah. in judging your friends and peer. Wow, that probably means that that probably means that we we are intuitive to what's going on with people, even when they don't realize. But anyway, I'm sorry, Cameron. No, I'm, thank you for putting that in perspective because I was like, wow, I judge people. Okay, no, not judging them in a bad way, but like you know, figuring out what's wrong. I got you now. That makes that makes sense. Follow your intuition under circumstances where logical thinking has no scope (laughs) (laughs) this is the time to explore the hidden potential within you 
stir away from any argument as they may create a problem for you later. And this is coming from Procuria.com, I guess is what this is. So, A, the, they're not necessarily the views of uh, the, so, the Ask of Lonnie Shore, or K. Rose. I, so I told you people, listen, ain't nothing to do with me. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's what you said, okay? Whoever star sign that wants to go and read that star sign, whichever, you know, wherever you want to get your information from, that's you. That's on you. I'm not doing with me. We, this is not, we are not advocating this. <laughs> time just stops just put out there. My time is running out, K Rose. It's not fair. What's the time gone? Oh, we did what we could do with what we had. Let's put it that way. Oh, oh, people. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's show. And I have to say a drum roll again. We have been on Facebook live broadcasting. Mm-mm. So just in case you weren't listening on internet or any of the other stations, you could see, well, hear us on Facebook Live today. So that's been another, you know, advancement in technology for us here on the Ask Avani Show. We like that. Woo! woo! <laughs> <laughs> so I want to take the time to start saying a big thank you to everybody for listening and joining in, wherever you may be, your tweets and everything. You know, we love the love, as I like to say. And I, you know, my time is running out on me and I, I'm going to have to relinquish the airwaves. You know I don't like to do that, but mm, it's got to be done. Now, just in case you missed today's show, it's going to be replayed again tonight, Saturday night, 9 p.m. UK GMT. If you don't know how to find us and interact with us, you can come and find us on social media. Here goes Twitter at Ask Amani Show. You can join the Ask Amani Show Facebook group page. Come and find me on LinkedIn, Avani Singer Songwriter. I am loving it. So many people have been finding me on social media. It's been fantastic. Please keep it coming. Come and find me on Instagram at UK Soul Queen Diva. I am live and in effect. You can listen to the Ask Avani Show podcasts on iTunes, Google Play, Stitcher, TuneIn and Spreaker. I want to take the time to say a big thank you as per usual to K Rose. You're welcome, Avani. Mm, mm. This has been your UK Soul Queen Diva. I am signing off, signing out. Take care of each other and yourselves. We will be back on radio and on social media again with you very soon. It's been real. Woo! <laughs> Bye. <laughs> You have been listening to the Get Global Network podcast of the Ask Avani Show. You can hear the show live on Saturdays at 3 p.m. in London, 9 a.m. Central Time in the U.S. on SoMetro Radio, one of the original member stations of the Get Global Network. Listen to the show on the go or hear replays of previous shows by installing any of the Get Global Network apps like SoMetro Magazine for your cell phone. The apps are available for download on both Google Play and iTunes App Store. Take the time to subscribe to our podcast via iTunes, Stitcher, TuneIn, or the Spreaker podcast networks.